peeps i think i'm now ready i just took a bath and then i'm now going to the mall it's now 2 p.m i really hope that i'll be able to find the gifts that i'm looking for and like this span two three four five six and this span of five hours i hope that i'll be back here by 7 p.m so i can rest and i can watch squid game so this is my view well if i'm waiting for the elevator yeah you can see a lot really you really cannot see the KLC yeah but this is the elevator going to my unit and i have to use like an access card so in each elevator you need to have the access card or else you cannot go in the floor ah, so security so it's very tight <laughs> just press this and so the cars will stop so that is the train station just very very near actually it seems like it's a nice day it's not too hot and not too cold okay the next train is within eight minutes if you are in a hurry you really need to like a lot of time for you to wait for the train so i'm just gonna sit here i'll sit here in front of this electric fan okay this is the train oh this is nando's oh no this is like super super delicious yeah so this is the mall where in the twin towers is located and it's a very like tourist destination kind of mall okay before i will go and look for gifts i'll just show you where the klcc tower is located so if we go out we'll see the tower um you can actually go inside but i think it will cost around 70 ringgit which is even in pesos that's around like hmm oh my gosh my math is not working 70 times 12 maybe around 800 900 if i have the time because in the in the petronas tower they also have the philharmonic orchestra i really wanted to watch so that's like my type you know like going to philharmonic orchestra watching plays so but then i check and they are still closed they will only open next year so if i have the time i'll be able to like also um bring you guys over there truly we'll go there at the end with the stairs and that because the, the tower is over here yeah you can go you can go there to the like the bridge maybe you know one time i'll also go there again because i i've been there like twice um yeah and then take you guys there for the ride wow so i have a lot of like series now for my tita in malaysia <laughs> so go to the t go to the tower again and show you guys and also go and watch the philharmonic orchestra you'll usually see all of these tourists they will definitely definitely like try and get the perfect shot of this um, of this twin towers uh, I believe that's it um, yeah it's just a nice like landmark right Ni a ni super nice landmark to go if you guys are around Malaysia Kuala Lumpur usually usually people would, would really go here and just like take pictures like all of those guys there's another like area at the back the area wherein you can do jogging and stuff so yeah but this is the perfect um, spot if you want to like go for a for a picture and then you post it on Facebook and say hey I went to this KLCC tower like what I said before you can really go to this to the this bridge it will cost around like 70 ringgit if I can still remember correctly 
I did check the website just right now, and if you are a foreigner, it's 80 ringgit, but if you're a Malaysian citizen, it's only 28 ringgit. And here you can see the prices for child and senior citizen. You can go here, and then you can go like, uh, like a certain floor, so maybe one day, I'll, I'll go again and show <laughs> so that it'll be fun right so yeah you can take pictures there you can see the other side as well this is the KLCC tower again I am now inside of the mall and I'm going to look for gifts so oh yeah my mom wants a Birkenstock <laughs> and then my brother wants to have like a facial scrub this is my favorite store like one day like seriously guys one day one day i'm going to buy a prada bag like i'm planning to like really save up money and buy a prada bag huh. and I, I don't even know i don't even know what design but oh this looks cute right like i don't even know what design but i'm like i'm gonna buy a product bag so i just want to take a, a video of killian murphy because he is so hot and he is such a great actor and i love him peaky blinders fam where are you at yes i saw it finally okay guys so i have uh, already brought for my mom and for my brother because my brother is like asking for you know a facial cleanser but i bought him a moisturizer i am successful i already brought gifts so the only one that i am not uh, like i'm still pending is my sisters but i already know what to get her so yeah oh man like it's so expensive you know like buying gifts but it's also fun to, to shop and and to give things away what i notice is that a lot of people are so rich i mean i really feel like they during the pandemic right there's nothing to do so their money is just stuck in their wallet and now they're like splurging like people can easily buy luxury items here it's crazy like a lot of people i saw is, um is lining up in christian dior and also with um well louis vuitton yeah though they like that they like louis vuitton actually like i've noticed malaysians like louis vuitton i don't i i mean not to be that kind of person i feel like it's totally it's not I, I i don't know it's too flashy like how <laughs> how the design is made for lv it's like too flashy <sighs> well that's just me i guess but the things that if ever i have like a lot of money and i want to buy i'd really buy prada and patek Philippe. those two are like my top the target for me oh my gosh they are so expensive so i really need to buy like i have a project wherein i'm not going to buy anything and then at the end of the year i'll buy like a prada bag you know something like that <laughs> kicking off so here yeah this is this is one of the brands that i really really would like to have but their price range is so expensive like seriously it's it's around millions but yeah they're like one of the well, top really at the elite and then and then their the way that they advertise or like their brand strategy is that you don't buy it you don't buy a Patek Philippe watch it's a legacy so you hand it over to, to like somebody which is kind of cool like yeah that's how they sell their brand oh is that human yeah so this is KLC Hey, 
made it it rained while i was going down on the train station but now i am back and i'm gonna show you what i bought so <laughs> i am right on time i well it's around 7 30 but i was targeting 7 p.m i'll be back because i don't want to stay too long out and i don't know i just really want to be ready for the sun for the monday which is tomorrow okay so these are the things that i have bought as a gift so my mom has for birkenstock so yeah and and a while ago during in, in the store we were communicating so i took it like a very very long time there inside the stores with the people like the sales person or the sales people there were very accommodating and they're like no take your time it's okay so my mom already knows what this is this is for my brother because he wants to have like um a like a facial wash but then i brought i bought him a moisturizer so i'm just gonna give him a facial wash i love shiseido like um it's like the brand that i really like that's the thing with me if i use it i also want to give it as a gift or like for people to use it as well <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm such a good marketer maybe yeah and then this one is for my sister actually my mom said that like sh my sister is having like rough hands thing like so she wants a lotion so i'm just like yeah you can have the lotion i also bought a perfume but the perfume was mine so my sister so i'm just gonna tell at the eyes like if you want the perfume like go ask your husband for that and then yeah i have two zara perfumes that i'm gonna give and then I have these clothes that i'm gonna i'm gonna uh, give to my brother and my sister in law in australia i cannot give lotion or perfume um it's against the policy um, going to australia because perfume are flammable and then i think lotion i'm not sure if i can give lotion but yeah because i need to ship it out to australia so that's it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this tita in malaysia video which went to klcc and you were with me looking for gifts it was quite tiring but i'm glad that i'm back home and i hope that yeah you have a great Bye.